Hi right, guys, welcome to another edition of Uzibo Tech. In this content, I'm gonna show you some basic iPhone tips. Basic iPhone tips. I was only thinking you should know. So first of all, let's start by how to hide up from your iPhone, especially the home screen. So you start up by you just select the app you want to hide so let me choose the youtube studio so you just long press the app then you go to move up then you go to move from home screen so you can see the app is actually missing from the home screen to find this app again what you have to do is you can go to the search or the app library and type in yt studio you, you may see the app has been reappeared so that's how you hide up from your iphone go to restore back up on the home screen or what you gotta do is to long press on the app and just select out to home screen and you see the app has appeared on it original position. Another tip is how to hide photos. So you just go to photos. You select the photos you want to hide. And then you come down here. Then you, see, you come to hide photos. Yes, hide to photos. Then you move back to albums. You can see, you can find those pictures you selected here in the hidden album so whenever you open this hidden album you, you will see the photos selected that you want to hide so to totally hide this hidden album what you have to just you have to do is just move to settings then you move up downward to photos in settings then as we can see the hidden album it is written when enabled the hidden album will appear in the album tab under utility so to hide this hidden album in photo then all you have to do is toggle this hidden album off then you move back to photos as you can see the hidden album is actually missing to to restore this hidden album back or this hidden photos but what you have to do is to move back to settings and go to photos in settings and toggle back on the hidden mm -hmm. album welcome back to another tip another tip is that as you want to whenever you want to switch on the torch of your iphone what you have to do is you long press this torch icon here as you can see the torch it's been turned on so to switch off this torch without long pressing this torch button or icon here what you have to do is just swipe left here and as you can see the torch is turned off without long pressing this and that tip is that maybe if you are typing let's say and you made a mistake you made a mistake and you wanna bring the insertion or the blinking bar in between words instead of holding the bar and moving it along side in between words it's a way too boring or what you have to do is just long press the space bar and drag on the space bar as you can see the, the insertion point is moving in between west things as you can see the insertion point is moving in between letters way too easy as compared to holding it and move it alongside in between letters just hold it long press the
this bar and drag on it and move it alongside in between like this another iphone 3 is on the safari browser maybe you've been the safari browser and you want to cruise tab instead of closing individual tabs one by one you can just you know, press here and select close all five tabs as you can see all tabs have been closed kindly leave your comments and share this video with family and friends see you next time on who's both take don't forget to subscribe for more